In this video, we are going to see how can we quickly create addition or the subtraction columns for a table in Microsoft Excel. So let's just get started with it. Here we have a table or basically two columns which are named as num1 and num2. We have some numbers in them. So I have just created a column as total. This column will contain the addition of the two numbers. So let's see first of all how are we going to add these two numbers. The steps are very simple you gotta come in the column or in the cell where you want the sum of the numbers you gotta put a plus sign select the first cell then again put a plus sign and then select the second cell once you press enter you will find that the total column is now considering the sum of 9 and 5 that is 14 if you want to perform the step again for all of them you can just drag it all the way to the last digit so you can see we have got the total of all the numbers there is another way through which we can do that so let's just create another column and that would be the total two column so for this we are going to use a formula of excel so while using the excel formulas you always got to put an equals sign first then you got to write the formula so the formula is sum you can put a tab then select the two columns uh, that is the first column then put a comma and then the second column from which you want the numbers then close the parenthesis and press enter so the result would be same but it is a little bit longer process than the previous one so this is how you can create a sum of these digits suppose you want a difference or a subtraction of these two digits or basically any digits then how do we do that let's just try the first thing that we did that is the first column uh, the minus sign the first column minus sign the second column so what will it do is it will always create the sum because that is minus 9 minus 5 which will give us just the sum of the two columns so for this what we can do is directly use the formula that is um, equals okay so we are just going to put equals put the first number put a minus sign and then the second number then you can press enter so that would bring up the difference you can just drag it all the way to the bottom to get the difference of all the numbers in the similar way so that's how you can create vertical addition and subtraction columns from the already existing columns in excel that's all for this video thanks for watching